Before moving on, I want to make a brief comment about your goals as a parallel algorithm designer with respect to work and span. One goal is to achieve a degree of work that matches the best sequential algorithm. I called this goal one of achieving work optimality. Now I want you to hearken back to the days of sequential algorithm design your just for a sec. Now from what you learned back then, your holy grail was to find a linear time or even sublinear time sequential algorithm. This isn't always possible, but it's a good goal. And since you want to be work optimal, that grail is the same with respect to work in the parallel case. So what's the holy grail for span? So what I'm going to do is I'm always going to ask you to find algorithms with polylogarithmic span. So polylogarithmic means log n to some power. So that might be log n, log squared n, log cubed n, and so on. So always remember this principle of polylogarithmic span. That's what we'll mean when we say low span. So what's special about polylogs? Well, since log n grows asymptotically a lot more slowly than n, and since O of n is our work goal, then polylogarithmic span ensures that the average available parallelism grows with n. Now, you'll always have to use your judgment about whether a given parallel algorithm has good work and span, but please use these ideals as a guide.